Hi my friends, welcome to another video. This is Diamond Painting with Coco. Coco is my dog Chihuahua and my name is Rainy. And I'd like to say hi to all of my subs. We're almost at 250, you guys. Maybe when this video hits, I'll be past 250. So thank you so much for your support. I so appreciate you guys. And if you're new here, I hope you choose to stay and enjoy the content. Today, I am going to be kitting up what is called Sunset by Diamond Dots. So it is April 2024 for future reference. And this month, my goal was to work on only small paintings. So that's what I've been doing. Um, kind of in fun. Um, you know, Diamond Dots isn't the best quality. Um, I'm, I kind of got, you know, spoiled working on premium company paintings, but I am getting through them. They are in my stash. I do need to do them. So it is what it is. So what I'm going to start is by, sorry, the words. What I'm going to start doing here is I need to cut off this legend in order to put it through my Xyron sticker. Now, someone mentioned, they were super sweet about it too. Um, and I mentioned this in another video. So I think it was my kidding down in my birdhouse videos video. Um, they said, you know, just make a color copy of it. Well, I don't have a computer, so I, I, that option is not available to me. So this is what I have. Diamond Dots doesn't come with an inventory sheet. They don't come with stickers. It doesn't come with a thumbnail. I've been drawing in my log books to the best of my ability, pictures of my paintings. So yeah, so my option is to put this through the Xyron sticker maker. Now, I made the mistake last time of accidentally forgetting to put washi tape down. My Xyron sticker is a, it's a permanent, it's not the repositionable one. So yeah, we will make sure this time that I am putting down the washi tape, which is this. I picked up this one. There's not very much left on it, so I might have to change it midway through. This painting has 25 colors. I'm going to be using this cube system. It's the individual cubes. So we'll be using that. Um, I'm going to put the washi tape down first because I forgot last time and uh, yeah, that was not fun to have to clean all those off. So I hate that. Don't you guys hate that? Let me see if I can find the, the line here somewhere. There we go. Hope you guys are doing well today. Hope everything is, is okay in your life. I'm not gonna get too technical with this here. Although I do need a smaller piece since these open the way that they do. It's really sunny here today. It's just beautiful outside. Just gorgeous. Summer's coming. Boy, I don't know where this year's gone. I feel like we were just in January. Do you guys feel like that? Let's see. I, yeah. I feel like it was just January. Just literally. I just feel like the year has just gone by so fast. I had all these goals and... Um, it's just like boom, 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 boom. What did I say? 25 colors. Okay. Yeah, this will be nice getting this down. These want this washi tape. So we had a nice time last night with our son. We watched um, Dungeons and Dragons. It's got Chris Pine in it. It's got a lot of people in it, actually. Uh, Hugh Grant's in it. And the girl from um, The Fast and the Furious is in it. She's like a main character. Um, it was really good. There's some really funny parts in the movie. We 
with that. Okay, how many have I done so far? I'm gonna cut those pieces off because they're that's gonna be a problem for when I'm opening and closing these, I think. Does this have any APs in it? No, it doesn't. And I will not be embellishing it either. Yeah, I'm gonna cut this off. I'm not gonna embellish the, the painting. Nope. Have no interest in doing that whatsoever. I've been embellishing my mandalas. Oh my gosh, they look so good. I can't wait to show you guys. That's another one of my goals is to get that done before the end of April. So we shall see. We shall see. Can I do it? I'm trying to think of how many paintings I've done for this month. Uh, one, two. Three, four. This will be my fifth painting for the month. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm trying to get one more. Um, yeah, and then I have another painting. Let me just cut this one off. I have another painting. Actually, that one's fine. That's this one. Um, that I'm going to do. So I will have a minimum of six paintings for this, but keep in mind, okay, they're, they're small paintings. I mean, this one is 36 by 27. So yeah, I don't consider that to be a large painting. All right, let me put my washi tape away. Then we're going to get to these numbers. All right, let's speed this through. I have a trick for you guys. So with your Zyron sticker makers, it's not about this part. I mean, yeah, you need to keep this straight, okay? But in order for it to not turn to the side or get twisted, this is the important part. When you're pulling this paper through, make sure that you're pulling it straight through. Keep it absolutely straight. Okay? That's, that's how you do it. That's how you keep it straight. So, and rub it down. I, I wanna get the repositional tape, but they're always out of it. They are always out of it. <gasps> Thank you to my subscriber. Oh my gosh, I don't remember your name. I do not remember your name right now because I just thought of this. Otherwise I would have looked it up before I did this video. So I've been waiting for these paint gems, these paint gem sets. I've been waiting for goth, autumn, tiles, and windows. I've been waiting for them. They've been out of stock. Like every time I go and check, they're out of stock. And one of my subscribers, oh my gosh, bless her heart. Thank you so much. She saw my video and she said, hey, they're back in stock and I instantly went and I bought all four of them. So thank you, thank you, thank you to that subscriber. I so appreciate you. <sighs> yes. I don't know if it was like that day that they had gone back in or what, but yeah, pretty stoked about that. Wait till you guys see the diamond painting that I got from um, Diamond Art Club. You guys know I like dark paintings. I've been doing a lot of really colorful light ones lately, but if you go back to my roots, you know that I like dark paintings and um, this one that I got is no exception. Oops. Okay, and I'm going to kit up an order of number, letter, and symbol. Okay, I can't find the conversion chart for uh, Diamond Darts ABs to 
uh, DMC numbers. I can't, I can't find it. Okay, it would help if this was right side up. So we do have a number one. I don't see a number two. We have a three. Keep it on the washi and we have a seven. No, wait. Yeah, I, well, I know we have a seven, but hold on, I'm seeing if we have a, nope. Okay, number seven. And we have a number nine. I don't, for the life of me, I do not know how companies come up with these, uh, with the way that they do things. Okay, now we're gonna do letters. So F looks like our first letter. F, G, H, we do have an H. I, do you have anything that looks like an I? I, J, we have a K. Did we have an L? Do I see an L in here? No, L, M, we do have an N. I count this symbol right here as an O, this one right here. So, O, did we have a P? I thought I saw a P. P, Q, no, no R. No S, we do have two T's. So we have an uppercase T, lowercase T, U, V, no, okay, we have an X and we have a Y, okay. Now I'm gonna do arrows because I see a lot of arrows. I count this corner one as an arrow because it just, to me, looks like an arrow. So we have one, two, three. This also looks like an arrow to me. Four, why do they have so many arrows? Five, that's okay. Okay, those are our arrows. Now we're gonna do math. So we have equals, which could also be a line. So I'm gonna actually hold on to that. Okay, so we have plus percentage. Okay, then I'll put the equals and then I'll put my line. So it can kind of be, oh, I'm getting that sticky stuff all in my fingers. The stickery stuff, okay. And then I just have three random, which is fine. Okay. All right, we have our cubes ready. Watch out for the crinkling. Oh, I still have the tool kit in here too. I might keep that for something, I don't know. Okay, now here comes the fun part because as per usual, no matter how you kick this up, you're, you're gonna have to be searching for something. So uh, where's the first train? Here's the first train right here. It's A2, 310, I bet it is. Okay, so A1 is number one. Oh, I forgot my little scissors. We will be using my big ones today. I always scare myself with these scissors. They're the big ones. I love these cubes, they hold so much. Okay. So A2 is right here. Yeah, this has got to be 310. And my hands aren't doing me any favors today. I'm having a bad shaking day. 
my, um, if you're new here, I have a tremble in my left hand due to medication and some days it's really bad and other days it's not. Today it is really bad. Okay, A3 is number three. See how it just shakes, it's so embarrassing. Okay. Pretty green, did I get all of it? There we go. A4, where's A4? Right here. What I count as the letter Y, even though it's a, it's a symbol, but to me it really looks like the letter Y. There's hardly any of this. Oh my goodness. So I'm gonna be starting this painting today, I think the 12th of April. So I think I'm going to start it today in A5. That's A25. Here it is, the letter F. Okay. It's just, it's so nice outside and I feel really bad about being inside today because it's so nice out. My husband's out there working. A6, oof, there's like 10 drills here. A6 is the slash number, oop, I got a drill here. A6 is the slash, not to be confused with the flash. Look at that. Okay, then we have A7. That's the number seven, or at least they did that. <clears throat> I wonder how this painting will turn out. Oof, that's a bright orange. Jeez, that'll wake you up in the morning. Okay. We have A8 right here, the equal sign. Getting better at kidding these up. Uh, boy, when I first, first started doing it, I was hurting. This has a little bit of static in it. I didn't bring my static card. Okay, well, if, if the static is too bad, I'm gonna go grab my static card, so, but right now we're fine. This is just a little bit. Okay. Oh, I see actually a lot of bags that have static. That's not true. I see another bag that has static. It's the very next bag. No, I see the next three that have static. Yeah. I'll be right back. I'm gonna grab my static art. had my fun with static. I've done the static thing. Been there, done that. Don't want to do it anymore. I absolutely hate static. It's just, there's no use in putting up with it. So, I sprayed both sides of the ketchup because sometimes I forget which end I sprayed. Okay, 89 is where is it? Number nine, okay. Oh no you don't, Mr. Static. Oh no you don't. So I'm just, if you're new to 
that I'm painting. I'm just using static guard for the static. You can use dryer sheets and shake it around. You can um, blow into it to get the static out. Not blow into it, but um, as if you're trying to fog up a mirror. That's what you do to the to the bag. Um, I've done that too, so that also works. Look at that, just goes right in. Okay, A10 has static. It won't for long. Okay, A10. Let's see. Wow, I really don't see it. Oh, here it is. again just rub it around it just needs a little bit just try to touch all the drills it comes right out let me move my garbage closer I'm like reaching for it okay Eleven has static. Okay, eleven is my arrow going to the side. I'm dropping a lot of drills here. A lot of drills from my trash jar. Wonder what I could do outside. <laughs> Hmm, maybe just sit on the front porch, I don't know. My husband's busy working, so, working on the yard, 812. A12, not 812. Let's see right here, the arrow. More static, oh my. Well, aren't you feisty? cut it all the way because the drills are like all the way at the top. Nope. Nope. I love this stuff. I kept hearing people talk about it and I was like, no, dryer sheets are fine. I can do it with dryer sheets. Well, you can, but I'll tell you what, this saves you so much time. And you don't need to put a dryer sheet in it now, it's because the static's gone, so it's, that it's a, that's another plus. Okay, A13. Here we are, the letter H, or as our friends from across the pond would say, H. There's a drill here. I don't want to cut it. There we go. Hello to my friends in the UK. I hope you guys are doing well. I watch a lot of you guys over there. A14. A14. Good people. I think everybody in the diamond painting community are good people. You know, it's a great hobby. I don't think there's drama. Maybe there's drama and I just don't know about it. I don't want to know about it if there is drama. So I'm, I'm a drama free zone. Please and thank you. Drama free. That's the way I like it. No, but I just think that it just seems like we're all 
for the most part on the same page as, you know, we're just diamond painting, sharing our experiences, our diamond paintings, and how we do certain things, and maybe it'll help somebody, and yeah, boy, I, I'm dropping drills everywhere. Maybe they're jumping out. Um, the static art lasts a long time too, from my experience. I mean, like for this kidding up, it'll last for this kidding up. You know, but this, there's only 25 colors, so. I think if you had a kit that maybe has like 40 or something, you'd probably have to respray your Q-tip. Okay, what's our next number here? A16. I think we're coming out of the static zone, right? Does this have, this doesn't have static. A16, shout it out people. Okay, it's the plus symbol. Please don't let me cut myself. Oh, that was good. Wow. Oops. This painting will probably take me two days. I don't know if I'm gonna start it today or not. I kinda wanna work on my mandalas. We'll see. So weird how you get some bags with static and then the very next bag it's like, there's no static. Not weird. A18. Okay. A18. Wow. Brain. I'm trying to brain right now. Can you guys hear the dial up sound? <laughs> I literally, okay. A18. There we go, the letter X. Yeah, I had the series dial up going on. A19. A19. Letter N. There's a lot of this color. Oh my gosh, this bag's almost full. I wonder how many, um, oops, I'm sorry. I, I just bumped you guys. If you're diamond painting, I just bumped the camera. Um, I wonder how many drills these cubes can hold. Oops, well. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I need to clean that up. Yeah, I wonder how many of these hold. Like that almost filled it up completely. So I, I could still fit a little bit more in that, but. A20, A20, here it is, I don't think it would be hard to find, there's not that many, for the love of God, a lot of oranges, yellows, browns in this one. Sunflowers, blues, love blues, A21, right here, the percentage sign. Yeah, so what I'll do, it, I don't know if you guys can see this, but they have this fake, it's not fake, but there's a border that goes around their canvases. Oh, I see a couple travelers in there. And so what I do is I'll just cut all of this part off, the white part off, and then I'll put washi tape down 
since I cut the legend off. And it, it looks really good when I'm done. So, um, I don't mind cutting my canvas off. I don't, th that doesn't bother me. A22. Right? Yeah, A22. <laughs> the letter T, lowercase T. Yeah, I kind of don't like kidding these down because of the conversion. It's not very much fun to kit them down. A25. A25. Right here, the letter K. Just the tiniest bit of yellow. Um, I think I have uh, five, no. Yeah, I think I have five or six more diamond dots left in my stash. I seriously do not think I'm going to be able to get all of those done this month. So I will continue on another month at some other time and make another set of goals for myself. Like next month is my birthday. My birthday's in May. I'm a Taurus. Whoop whoop if you're a Taurus. Who's a Taurus out there? Represent. Um, I have a very special painting that I've been wanting to do. And it'll take me a couple weeks to do it. Eight, last one, 825. Where are you? Nisha, here it is. Ooh, that's not good. <laughs> okay, not a big deal because there's one that's missing and I can't see it. I have to turn this upside down. Okay, so it's this one right here. What is that? Ah, A23, so this has to be A23. Yes, hear that helicopter. It is so <gasps> oh my god. It is so low. I could literally see the pilot. I'm not even exaggerating. Wow. Why was it so low? I didn't even think they were allowed to go that low. Okay, so that should be correct. Um, I don't know. There wasn't very much of either one of those colors. So if I messed it up, I'll, I'll, I didn't, I don't think I messed it up. And here are the colors on the back. Look how pretty that is. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful. Mm, this case is all scratched up. Okay, my friends. Well, that is the kidding up of sunset. Um, and obviously I will be letting you know when I've completed it because I will be doing a kit down. So I hope you've enjoyed this video for today. If you wouldn't mind hitting that like and subscribe button, I would appreciate it so much. And I will talk with you soon. Loves.